Hey guys, so it is time to take a look at 14 star fully arts boosted Goku and Bardock here. Here we go. We have 99 to all of the arts types here, 13,000 to stats. So in terms of stats, we're looking at 272 to strike, 261 to blast, um, and then over 190 to both defenses. I mean, in terms of like, you know, fully maxed out arts boosted 14 star characters that are LFs, yeah, obviously I'll take these stats. The defenses are very solid. Um, I, I mentioned this in the prior few showcases for this character, but I do actually think the offenses are a little low. Um, but keep in mind, this character more than makes up for that by stacking sustained damage cut penetration with their strike. And it's on both sides too. Like it's Goku and Bardock doing that. So that really does make a difference. I feel like now with the level of sustained damage cut that exists in the game on all these characters, getting a way to basically ignore that is super powerful. It's even more important, I think, than just having more damage. So uh, this character should be looking extraordinarily good with the max arts boosted stats there. Uh, now the team... I was kind of playing around with different team builds for this character. I was wondering like how I wanted to build this. Now this is not like, th this is actually like, you're, you're, a lot of you guys are probably gonna look at this team and be like, oh my God, this is such an, a ridiculously overpowered, insane team. I would agree, but a lot, all three of these units are very individual characters. They're very selfish characters. I think probably Goku and Freeze is probably the least selfish character. Um, but the thing that makes all these characters selfish here is they all want to be attacking, right? Especially the Blue Kaioken Goku and Evolution Blue Vegeta. They're going to be building up their gauge literally from using cards. And then Goku and Bardock build up their gauge by tag switching, which I mean, you could do defensively as well, but obviously it's going to be a lot better um, for them if you're attacking mostly with them to build up their unique gauge. Um, and then Goku and Frieza, just being able to combo forever with Frieza's cover nullification and stuff like that. Um, yeah, uh, that's... We'll see. We'll see how this works. I don't think in terms of roles, this team functions the best in terms of just like synergy between all the units here. Um, but individually, we're just running th th uh, three really strong units is how this is going to go. Uh, we're also going to be double Zenkai buffing them. Now, I am going to be doing a separate four times Zenkai buff video for this character plus arts boosted. So they're going to be at like max power in that one. But um, I did want to give them some extra Zenkai buffs here. Plus, we are going to have a Zenkai buff each for uh, the other two characters, too. And then we have the Kakarot Goku in the bench giving uh, HP. Now, we are going to be running this. I think this is a very powerful equip for the character. Um, I'm not a huge fan of base critical in slot one here, uh, but slots two and three are very powerful. 10% HP is always really good. And then slot three, 20% base strike and then 15% to pure strike if this character's team Bardock. There's a lot of damage. This character's getting a lot of damage from this. Uh, the second one, because we're running a full Sun Family setup, we're going to be able to make use of this unique equipment here. So we're getting a bunch of defenses and then 12% to pure strike and blast attack. And then lastly, we are going to be running this as well because we are running Goku and Frieza. So uh, more more HP and then 10% to pure and uh, so, sorry, pure strike and blast attack here. So a lot of pure stats because we're getting double Zenkai buffs. So let's go ahead and jump in. I think they're going to look very, very powerful in this setup. Alrighty, let's see what we got here. I'm not really too sure. What is this? Janemba universe reps, I guess. Um. Oh, he has a green. Damn. I'm gonna go into Goku and Frieza then, just to sort of spread the damage around here. Now we do have Goku and Frieza's gauge, of course, to help alleviate this damage, and then we also have Goku and Bardock's indestructible mechanic. Yeah, th almost 3.5 million health. Wow, look how well they're tanking Janemba. That's cool. That's insane. That is insane. This is fine. We can just go into Vegeta for this. The way they ate that Janemba strike card. Like, I know this is not Janemba's, like, mega juiced up setup, but that is impressive. Okay. Let's just buy time to get our vanish back with Frieza. He has a green. Thank you. Can we just kill? Nah, I can go to Janemba. I mean, is he dead? Oh my god, Bardock. What the hell? <laughs> Look at this. What the hell? <laughs> He's probably like, oh, my Janemba died. Oh.
All right, now what? Dude, I, please draw that green card. Thank you. Okay. Goodbye. Yes. Okay, pretty good first match for them. Damn, he's leading with Orange Piccolo. Okay, that's not too common to see that. Um, all right, we'll just press this. I mean, this is not really too crazy here. Nothing to worry about yet. Goku can eat this. Yeah, that's fine. Remember, Goku takes less damage from blues here, so we're not going to really eat this for that much. Yeah, look at that. Look how well we, we, ate, we ate that. That's crazy. All right. Go back to Piccolo. There you go. Just hit him with this. Surprised he went to Gohan for this? It's gonna hurt. Yeah. Goes right away. Oh my god, that was fast. <laughs> what the hell was that? Uh, okay, this is gonna hurt. I am gonna go to Gokun Freezer for this. This, this is just to kill a card. Yeah, that's one other thing to mention about this team as well, I guess, is that there's really not like a super mega designated tank here. What? Who signs up there? Go to Piccolo. We can we can live with that. Alright, go to Piccolo. Oh, this is really good. Yes! Oh, wait, is that good, actually? I think it's good. Because we can just hit him with this. I did want to use that green for uh, Vegeta, though. Rush? Yeah, damn it. I shouldn't have pressed that. It's my, my fault. That was so obvious. I didn't... <sighs> I didn't think he'd actually brush there. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we did a lot of damage to Gogeta at least, so... Even with his gauge active, we should be able to just finish him off with Goku and Bardock at some point here. I don't think he'll main. I think we'll just float up. Wait, hello? What are you doing? What is he doing? Alright, get covering all here. I don't think we've even switched into <laughs> Vegeta and Goku yet. Uh, we do still have our Indestructible uh, available here. No rush, though. And I really don't want to go to Goku yet. Can these guys draw a card? Wow. God damn it. I had no, I had no way to get around this. Yeah. I think we have to use the... I think we have to use the indestructible here. That's fine. We can basically heal this all off. They almost live. They almost just straight up live that. That's crazy. That's so much damage. I'm not going to do anything. I want Vegeta to come back. Right away? Okay, you're just dead. I don't know why you'd do that. Why would you risk this? And one more card for Vegeta and we get his gauge built up. There's his gauge. Thank you. The one's going to transform. He can't kill our hand now. He just goes right away? Okay. What do I want to do here? I think I'm going to let Vegeta die. We're debuffing every time he does anything. What are you doing? Why won't you just transform?
陣なわじゃ金合いだな All right, this is cool. Full uh, Bardock team here. You know what the funny thing about this is? It's not even a Team Bardock team because this this guy's not on Team Bardock. The Dragon Ball Super Bardocks, for whatever reason, are not on Team Bardock. I, I actually I don't understand. It makes zero sense. All right, did we just kill him? Damn it, we draw a card. What? Why oh, that takes so long? I just get you. Sure. Dude, why am I charging? I'm just trying to move. What is going on? Please. Okay. I should probably just stay in with this Goku here. Try and build up to the gauge. Goku. Sounds good. That's dead. Right, we're locked in for like two counts. Nice. Uh, this looks like hybrids? Yes. Double beast. Uh, okay. Drop here. Hello, beast. Now we have cover and all, thank you. Let's go over to Bardock, our friend. All right, you better switch units. There you go. All right, thanks for the crit. I think we're gonna go back over to Goku. Nice to the cover and all again. I'm gonna actually drop here into the green. Hopefully he goes to Beast. No, he does not. I'm not even gonna go for the blue. I'm just gonna keep comboing. Switch. No switch. Okay. All right, pretty good opener. Okay. There's the transformation. Uh, this actually could be scary. Like, actually, I know how ridiculous that sounds, but. I'm gonna have these guys eat this. Ow. Okay. This character is uh, kind of a cheat code. Okay. Nice. That's pretty good for us. Don't switch. Don't switch. Don't switch. Okay. Cover all. Thanks. Go back to Goku. We did pick up the blue, which is excellent. We get covered all again here. Yeah. One more card, Goku. Perfect. <laughs> all right, we should kill her. Hey, goodbye, beast. <laughs> Thanks, legends. Appreciate the green card.
Alrighty, what do we have here? Let's just go right away. Damn, I thought he was going to go for a green or something. Uh, he's going to go to Bardock. Let's go into Goku and Frieza. No, go! Switch! Goku and Frieza, go! Go, go, Goku and Frieza! Okay. Oof. That's going to hurt. Got the dragon. Oh, not that bad. Let's not care about cover null now. Or about cover change now. Didn't draw a card, huh? Okay. Nice. I messed up there. I I wanted to drop, but I wanted to drop with the green card, but I already had the other one pressed, so I couldn't unpress it in time. That sucks. Doing okay? Right, I think maybe we'll just move on to the next fight. They're gonna live this, obviously. Oh god. Alrighty. Uh, okay. Actually, a pretty similar team to mine. He's just using UI over the Blue Goku and Vegeta. No sidestep right away. Okay. I really thought he would go for that. Well, we're going to take a lot of damage here. There's a long combo. Actually, he didn't go to... Wait, why'd you go to Goku and Frieza there? It was actually better for us. He's still doing a lot of damage, though. Okay. He's probably just going to go to UI. I can't really do much about it. Don't have a green. Let's drop here. Okay. Perfect. Hold on. Can he switch yet? No. Okay, he's just dead. Let's do this preemptively. And then we're going to go to you. Perfect. Oh, that green card draw. Perfect. That was a, that's a, that's what we like to call a destiny draw. We should be able to combo into going back to Vegeta. So if he goes to Goku here, we should be good. Okay. So we're going to activate his indestructible here, but I'm going to continue the combo. Actually, can we even continue this? We might just kill our hand before we can do anything. Yeah. Yeah, we drew a blue card too. That is that is really bad. Actually, hold on. <laughs> okay, sure. I guess we'll take that. Go cool. Go back to you. I'm surprised he didn't go to Frieza there. To rush us. I guess we go to you for that. No, he's going right away. Wait, what? That's perfectly fine. We just live this. How would you? What? Okay, that's we, we win. <laughs> thanks, we won. <laughs> I'll take that. All right, thanks for the free one. Then. Thanks, man. I'll take it. Massive value out of the indestructible mechanic here. Look at our health. <laughs> that's so stupid. We we'll drop. All right, so we already. Um, Filled up their gauge one time, right? No reason to go to Goku here. All right, now we rush. There's no way he was going to just sit there and do nothing. Yeah, that was massive indestructible value.
Alrighty, I think we might make this the final match here. We'll see. Damn, that's... I should have just pressed the blue here, actually. So grab the Dragon Ball. Um... Hmm. I'm not doing too much damage. There's a lot of health. 3.2 million health on this. Good, 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 good. Okay. Is he going to go to Frieza here? No. I'll just do this. Blue card with... Oh, he's gonna use it with him. I thought he was gonna go to Gohan for this. That's fine. What is he doing? Okay. Get ready. I feel like we should just go into you. Alright, goodbye. I'm gonna go right away here. We can afford to do dumb stuff like this, because we have indestructible. It was a risk, but... Oh! <laughs> what? You can't drop against this character! What are you doing? Wait, what? Did we not have cover null? What happened there? Did we not have cover null? Five counts. Definitely didn't elapse. I have to think about how that didn't have cover null. Okay. Interesting. You know what? I should have eaten that. I should have eaten that rush with Goku and Freeze just so I could connect the blue. That was, a, that was actually a misplay, I think. Let's green. Yeah, I think that was a misplay. Could have eaten it. Alright, are you gonna go to Frieza? Good we'll play. He is. Blue card. I think we'll just let this go off here, that's fine. Wow, they live that. That is crazy. That is crazy. They t yeah, dude, their tanking versus blue cards is insane. Because that heal that they do at, at the end of it. All right, so we have pick we need one more tag and then we have our full gauge ready. Nice. I mean, we should just rush here. Let's just go with this, and then we can go back to Goku. All right, Pickle is dead. Right, let's just go with this. He wants to rush. Go for it. Okay. This should be game over. So, yeah. Let me know down below what you guys think of 14-star fully arts-boosted Goku and Barak. They are very good. This is a very good character because it's like you compare this character to Goku and Frieza. And it's like they're kind of doing the same thing as Goku and Frieza. Obviously, they're, I would say, less of a team player than Goku and Frieza because they're, I would say Goku and Frieza's subcount manipulation is way better. Their gauge... Uh, in combination with that, it's going to make them a better Rising Rush deterrent character overall. But Goku and Barak are bringing like an AOE green to the table. Like, I I feel like any team you use wants an AOE green. It's just so easy to get combo started. It's honestly, it's like the most brain dead mechanic in the game at this point. So, I don't know. Uh, they're definitely very good. Um, I think, uh, you know, each character that we use in this team was able to shine individually in this video, but. Let me know down below what you guys think. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next one.